love. Haters, please forgive me. <laughs> if a lot of women got a man, they would not be as mean and bitter as they is. They got a good man. That's, the problem is they just be going with any man. Then he end up doing them dirty than the man they left before. So then they really be like, I ain't never heard you. That was to get a good man. You see a lot of healed and happy women. And then knock it off with the bullshit they be on. Capricorn, Aquarius, Cuspers. If you're a Capricorn, you can watch this. If you're an Aquarius, you can watch this. And if you're a Cusper, Capricorn, Aquarius, you can watch this. Interesting. Capricorn, Aquarius, Cuspers. Y'all, I know y'all some interesting people. We. Oui, oui. Oui. Y'all better friends than y'all are enemies. When I hit something that somebody going through, Nipsey always show his face. <laughs> like, yeah, you got that one right. You told me that was somebody. Like, boy. <laughs> I know he used to work Lauren nerves. He used to still work Lauren nerves from there. Heavens above. You hear me? Let's see what's going on, y'all. A lot of these readings are coming up with twin flame energies. Y'all in one, y'all about to be in one. Y'all in one, we are about to be in one. Even if not together, you're still in it. If you know, you know, you know. We're all ready to move on. It's just, it's just high though. You ain't enjoy with this shit. I'm sure. See, <laughs> don't say nothing. Don't say nothing because they ain't not coming up. That's why I cut my comment section off because they don't have to come over here talking about, you know, you know. <laughs> Some of y'all dealing with a Capricorn energy or a Casper. Some of y'all dealing with an Aquarius or a Casper. Capricorn energy. Damn, y'all. This is Capricorn, that's Capricorn, that's Aquarius Capricorn. Straight like that. Some Capricorns, y'all got water in your chart, or y'all customers got water in your chart. Yeah, you gonna get up with a hangman situation, I'm trying to tell you, didn't I just say that? The problem is you go with any man. And he end up doing you worse than it's your own way. You don't want to be patient. You don't want to work on you no more. I done did enough. I had one of my clients tell me she ain't really my client no more. But she said she had enough therapy. I knew she had not had enough therapy. For what happened to her and her child. <clears throat> Everybody different. You gotta know yourself. You know what I'm saying? Six of Cups. Some of y'all got baby fathers as crazy as a motherfucker. Some of y'all divine masculines got baby mamas as crazy as a motherfucker. Some people had baby mamas and baby fathers that were so fucking crazy. Nipsey! That was so fucking crazy. That some people made up in their mind, they just, they weren't going to be with nobody. Because ain't nobody about to deal with that kind of shit. And low-key bought, because motherfuckers like that always say the same program and bullshit. Ain't nobody going to want you but me. What? Where do you get that at? What book did you read that at? Who told you that? Who did you hear say that shit that you're repeating it? Because you know that it's not true. You don't want to go because you know who I am. 
and you know how I treated you. Remember? You know I'm a hot commodity on these streets. Did you lock that program shit on? You got attachment issues, bro. You need therapy. Maybe a little, uh, uh, Epicol. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> Divine masculine is ain't going nowhere. Some divine masculine, it's like a massive shift going on with certain men and they understand and they value one. And two, if you understand your own value, you definitely gonna recognize somebody else's. And you're gonna recognize who ain't worth it. Time. And time is very fucking valuable. <coughs> Somebody in the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. To the no, 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 no. You need a man with sensitivity. A man like me. Don't need a man to treat you funny. I'm all gonna show you to what you need, honey. Don't need a man that'll leave you funny. You need a man. With sensitivity, a man like me. Arguments, financial loss, conflict, fatal outcomes, <sighs> discord, manipulative family members, low vibes, financial issues, disagreements, theft, unhealthy risks, Temporary setbacks. Remain aware, but do not become paranoid or constantly distrustful of others. Weigh your options. I think they done made a decision that they're going to be with you because they out of money, they out of luck, and they out of their mind. Fucking with these energies. Out in these streets. Men have to come. Let me tell y'all something. Most men, most dudes that they would consider like thugs, you know, Tupac pretty much paint the picture for y'all. He wasn't even like hardly none of that. He just was like that. You know what I'm saying? Like a dude like Tupac, which is rare as fuck, but he'd be like somebody that's in fashion design school. But you run up on him the wrong way when he's sewing something, you fuck around and lose your teeth. Kind of situation. He was skinny, so people tried him. He came up in the ghetto, but he wasn't on any of that shit. He even had no children. I always talking about somebody's kids. All he was doing was reenacting stories he was hearing in the hood. He stayed in that motherfucker. But he had his little mansion and shit. He wasn't going to be like that. Who do? Yeah, this person... Y'all both got some crazy. Y'all, let me tell you, let me be honest with what I'm picking up. Both of y'all. People tend to get into the blame game instead of realizing y'all both been duped by a lot of motherfuckers. And it's usually because you was raised right. And you wanted to save people. Like my mother used to ask me, why do you keep, why do you keep bringing, because I always brought whoever I call myself liking to her. That's why I miss her so much, because I, be, I bring, listen, and she gonna look at me like, she gonna say, why do you keep bringing me all these birds with no wings? I'm like, listen, this, we in the ghetto. This was out here, honey. Honey. <laughs> Just pecking around. Mm. 
had ancestors. Some of y'all communicate with your ancestors. <sighs> y'all ancestors seeing how y'all being treated. Some of y'all by y'all co-parent. They real tacky. They don't want you to be with nobody else, but they know you're done. You trying? You at the four pentacles? Y'all ain't lost money. <laughs> you the ten of pentacles, and you back at the four. So they let you know your foundation always been solid. Y'all was raised right. You lost motherfucking money dealing with suckers and busters. Okay, male or female it don't matter. Suckers is androgynous, and so is busters. <laughs> I do not know when justice is like this. So, what this is to me, because he he come out sideways. So, with his attitude, problem happen ass. These type of motherfuckers irritate the fuck out of Tupac. <laughs> he ran with this one. See, you see what I'm saying? That's Illuminati all in his body. This is you just a silly. This is some stupid ass shit. Ancestors were some ancestors older, older, not Tupac now. That's why this nigga looking like this. You know what I'm saying? Just imagine these are the elders. They yeah, work like God, you know? Grace and mercy. You know? Ain't nobody just smite a motherfucker because a whole lot of people is stupid, okay? And they're going to see what's going on. You're going to keep on, or you've been learned enough. We're going to let you bust your head to the white meaning of that. You know what I'm saying? The Tupac be on some, uh, let's get it on. <laughs> Ready to bust this nigga ass <laughs> immediately. I ain't likely got to wait on there to see you. He, he be so used to the hand doing she been Look how long he been gone. Yeah, the pinnacles. Yeah, that's where y'all had it. Y'all are dead. I mean, that lets you know. All you get, let me tell you something. When you leave people that's not did you wrong, but you was raised right, you lose money. However, you don't lose the principle or the intention of how you treated people, which was more than likely fair. If you was raised right, you can't help but to. And sometimes they play you. And you just keep letting them to avoid, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, God, I get you. I'm going to get you. You know. You get some people, they already know. You about to, you want some bullshit. People like Tupac, you know. You can't let these motherfuckers. Like Nipsey said, got to keep the devil in this hole, nigga. Very short fuses. The ancestors be having patience. That was perfect. We've been keeping people in separation longer for real. Because also real shit, Tupac, he is like Uncle Bobby. He just want everybody to find somebody they love and live their life. Because this sort of fuck he wanted for himself. Just like Nipsey. All that extra shit, you already know Pimp C, honey. If you hear it, familiar with hip hop. Y'all niggas need to get up out that bullshit. <laughs> All that dumb shit, key walking. <laughs> <laughs> Let's forget on Martin Luther King. He ain't never had the time. I'm gonna get your ass handed to you. Watch one of his interviews, and he gonna get you together. Four of Cups. Somebody is detached, ready to move the fuck on, and they ain't never had this hand. They ready for a wish fulfillment, honey. They ain't never had this hand. They don't want so much money fucking with these. Yeah, that's it, right. Buster Rhymes. And Buster ain't no Buster at all. But, uh, the irony like a motherfucker. And he is more like Bust Rhymes. You know what I'm saying? Not Buster. 
already know he got flow. So we just look at you like, bust a rhyme, bust a move. Bust a motherfucker. Okay, so let's see. When in reverse, I mean, y'all are decided to. Capricorn and Aquarius energy together. Mac Miller, Capricorn. And that's a King of Swords. Frida is a Cancer, but I put her on Swords. She told me to. That's what the fuck I think. Okay. What do you think Channel is about? This one, too, this one, we, Generation X, and we have the lowest fucking tolerance level. Especially for people that was born in our generation to act fucking like DMX is acting out. You know what I'm saying? And he's a generation X. You know what I'm saying? Like, fuck race, cuz. <laughs> fuck race, old girl. Some people get caught up in thinking they can change people, especially when you was raised right. That shit, it'd be like, let it go. Beware of vanity, false guidance, self absorbed personality type, excessive, takes more than receiving, disengage, false leadership, lies, driven by ego, seeks attention, deceit, self deceit, self acclaimed. Lord have mercy. Be mindful of who you follow at this time. So, this is, this is a, Worry about it. Worry about it, sweetheart. Worry about it. <laughs> Just be, be mindful of you follow at this time. To me, that's saying be mindful, right? Be mindful of the fuck you dating at this time. It's better off to wait and get yourself more and more stupid and shit. That's like what, I, what it ended up happening and the people that just can't get it. They'll get back to the four pinnacles. They'll get all the way to the nine. And then they'll go back to the four. Because they were raised right. They just keep doing stupid shit. Making stupid choices. Because they, they're impatient. In the area of love. I know all about it. Trust me. I took the football route through life. Not a clear run to the goddamn finish line. Whatever the fuck touches down. Y'all know what the fuck. Getting hit in the motherfucking head. Somebody is doing too much. Yeah, man. That's like somebody divine masculine don't know magic. And somebody has a fucking ice queen. They do. Maybe making sure she uses that shit too. They know though. They they detach. They they magic basically ain't working no more. This one and the people are let God handle them. Kind of shit. Night of voices. Some of y'all know that. Y'all ain't supposed to be telling y'all to just be patient. Because you end up talking to somebody and feeling like this after you talk to them. Because you already know you're not even attracted to them. Keep coming up with goods. Trying to make yourself like them and then feel free once you know they ain't going to call you back no more. Tupac come in, like, man, get rid of this bitch. My baby mama got a mind full of silly games. <laughs> <laughs> My homie had a 
that baby by my old girl, but I ain't sweating now. Yeah, right. And some of y'all feel like that, that y'all find me on the tarot channel. Y'all get sick of some shit. I understand. Why till you follow Ten Cups? Y'all gonna get it right next to the wish fulfillment. Yeah, y'all gonna get this person. Yeah, Tupac, I know. Tupac, his, it's like this. He like, man, you keep saying this and ain't nothing happening. People gonna start thinking, but they don't understand. Shit be like low key on some protocol shit, on some of uh, the ranks, you know. Tupac ain't about to trump what Martin Luther King say, okay? It's not gonna happen. You listen. I'm it out. You know what I mean? <laughs> you pinnacle. You are no part of the king. He's a Capricorn. Oh, super. So angry. Did y'all ever hear the story where <laughs> Auntie Baya had a little pull up on Tupac? He had one of his off days. He was going nuts. He told her, look, I don't say that shit. I don't want to hear that shit. So I say that Martin Luther King shit. So I'm stupid. So I'm real ignorant, y'all. <laughs> she said, I didn't see you angry, young. She handled it so gracefully. She broke him down. She broke him down. She got to his heart space. He was like, oh my God, auntie. <laughs> <laughs> He can't take no petty ass shit. He cannot stand it right. <laughs> he like, can we at least put the niggas in jail? He don't want to happen. She giving up on that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Y'all know Tupac for the underdog, the reformed thumb. Oh my God. Ain't of emotions. Yeah, this ice queen, she she done. They about to they, they about to collapse on her mother. <laughs> For real, people do not know how to knock it the fuck off. Like, what in the fuck is wrong with you? Was it laying in the water when you was throwing up? When you came up in? Oh, <laughs> Project for that lead paint with that one you. You can still for that y'all need to do a class section also. Oh niggas. It was the vaccines. You know what I mean? I was vaccinated like fuck when I was a child. I think, I think a lot of generation actors are autistic. We just uh, high function. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, bro? Divine guidance. The search for meaning in life. Consider an altern alternative approach to around yourself with wise teachers or friends. Whoever the fuck y'all pop on the thing, they trying to warn y'all. Don't be watching everybody, listening to everybody. You're going to put your whole goddamn life away. And they do warn you. This ain't gonna fit for everybody. People just don't understand resignation for some reason. But you know when some shit is about you and when it ain't. Come on. Bring love into the situation. Aquarius energies. Or cuspers. <laughs> the high priestess. Powerful psychic insights, reflection, and meditation that provide valuable information. Be at peace. Be at peace. She is not a fraud. 
me. A fiery climax approaches. Some of y'all may be dealing with the Aries. Y'all Capricorn. Y'all 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 feeling too far. Y'all generation X and some of y'all. Huh? Past life relationship. You have known each other before. That's a key component to the twin flame journey. Usually it's past life. Peace. Release the past. There is a more enriching future coming. Let go and let God. I think y'all need that. I think y'all need that. I think y'all need it. You got to give it up. Stay determined and move forward. Be prepared for any possibility. Environmental activism. Some of y'all may be inheriting some land. Seven of Ariel. You have invested wisely. Have patience and wait for the harvest. Review your progress and make plans for the next endeavor. Yeah. Y'all may have had a date recently. It was like, no, oh, cancel. Oh, look at thick line. Sister Gabriel, congratulations. You've done a wonderful job. Time to move on to the next project, awards, scholarships, or promotion. Some of y'all are going to receive a promotion. Or you just started school or something like that. You just want a scholarship. Well, you will be. Take great pride in your excellent work. Practice makes improvement. Consider getting additional education or training. So me, I may be looking at colleges online or some type of certification. Get into it. That's how you pivot that energy. Instead of, what did it say? Hold on. Let me run it back. Not that going like that. Not that, not that, not that. Yeah. I think. No. Not that. Yeah. You have invested wisely. Have patience and wait for your harvest. Review your progress and make plans for the next endeavor. The next endeavor used to be y'all planning dates, going on dates. But now y'all gonna pivot and use that to, you know, tighten up on your schooling, get certified and something, build something, you know. King of Ga Gabrielle. Generous, inspirational, dramatic, driven. Keep your eyes on the big picture. Leave the details to others. Experience that leads to success. Genuine concern for others. So this divine masculine really is <clears throat> concern for you. What do you need to release? That's for somebody. Some of y'all don't let go and let God. Some of y'all need to release some more shit. Maybe, I don't know. You hold something against the divine ass and then blame them for something. Blame somebody, anybody. Just look at yourself. Don't even worry about nobody else. Just look at yourself. So when people start accusing you, you will know you ain't crazy and you know they need to get the fuck away from you. If you keep your eyes on yourself and people start fucking with you, you know it ain't you. Without a shadow of a doubt. So that's when you start subtracting. If you don't do nothing but wish people well and man your motherfucking business and people come fucking with you, y'all know who come fucking with you like. Hi, B. That's that. Don't come for me because I ain't sent for you. I ain't even think about your ass. You invited yourself. Okay, well, I don't need you to uninvite your motherfucking self. Because I was doing just fine without all the drama. Thank you. And then when they leave, you don't have nobody to blame. And they still be in drama. But somehow, because they want to add you in that shit some way, somehow. When you really get up off of dumb shit, when you realize you really ain't never been on it, you just been around it. You know what I'm saying? Perspective. There's a better way. Pause for reflection and insight. Dare to be different. Yeah, some of y'all, uh, Queen of Swords energies is being highly reflective. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. So do some visualizations of being with the Divine Masculine. The Empress. If you can't do that, then you still got guards up. Time to act upon your plans. Creativity is rewarded. Luxurious or abundant resources. Yeah. Y'all about to pivot y'all energy just to goals y'all set, 
visions y'all had, whatever the case may be. The wheel, new beginnings, inner delays, a changing direction that offers happiness. Y'all got the wheel twice. So something about to turn in y'all favor. Be patient. Pivot your energy to whatever this is that you're building or you're trying to perfect your craft or you're taking certification for something or you're going to school for something. Just shift your energy that way. Because uh, ain't nobody trying to be dealing with no damn. Come on. Incubus, succubus, vampire. You know, they know how to keep it tight for a certain amount of time. And then they start slowly breaking down if you pay attention. It's all the front. The whole goal is to get in your house. You know what I'm saying? Because the only house that a lot of them type of energies have will be prison. You say institutionalized or underdeveloped. You ain't do the work. But they want the prize. Which is a good one. Then. But how you gonna maintain her? You don't worry about that. Once they get in your house, they may cook for you. You know what I'm saying? Become like a Mr. Mom kind of shit. Eventually, start playing video games more than they want fucking cooking. How's nasty? You know? What they said they was gonna do, they didn't. I don't know. Don't let nobody in your house around your children. I'm going to tell you, this is a different time we live in. It ain't going to be like this always. God damn it, it's like that now. Act like you know. All right, y'all. If you're feeling the vibe, please like, share, and subscribe. Love and like.